Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and um, so how should I put this? <laughs> okay, we are rolled out, of course, of May 2020 update. For most people, it goes well. Uh, there's still a lot of people that don't see it, and there's a lot of people that actually won't see it on their machines. Once again, uh, one of the reasons I uh, make want to make sure to tell everybody not to force it, and a great example is a new problem that Microsoft is acknowledging today. And um, I'll rant a little here because, I mean, this thing has been tested since December. I can't understand that all of this has not been seen before. I can't understand that there is no insider somewhere that were testing this that didn't have that problem happen. Anyways, um... So for most people, it's not a problem because most people have a regular PC with just one hard drive or, and, and that's pretty much it. But um, some of you have complex drive configurations and partitions. And uh, so there's a bug that apparently for some will actually um, give problems with storage spaces. Some of your drives might actually show up or actually you won't see them so your pc when you go to your file explorer is gonna you know show you the main drive but might not show you the ones that the other ones that are attached and basically the storage spaces will show up as raw in the uh disk manager uh i gotta say um for a version that's been tested for so long there I think there really needs to be a change on the way Microsoft is testing stuff because this I, I you know we're expecting and it was expected that version 2004 rolls out well and now the more it goes and the more there's these little things showing up here and there so um, I, I don't get it not after five months of pretty much having no new features and just being updated all the time to make sure everything's all right so i'll share the uh, support page here if you have multiple drives and do wish to move on to version 2004 they have a little workaround uh which is um that powershell command which is totally stupid that you have to do this to make sure that everything is all right i i really come on okay so um anyways uh, virtual so anything that is storage spaces um, could be now um, you know raw and and if there was some stuff in there you might have some problems so um, they're of course telling you not to run the check disk command on any device affected by the issue and um, you know if you have s multiple hard drives if you have Special drive configuration, I think. Uh, I think for now, stay away from 2004. It's uh, just stay wherever you are and wait. There will eventually be a fix in one of the bug fixes. But um, So this adds to the list of uh, things that are messed up at Microsoft. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.